Hey guys, welcome back to another episode, and this is new, this is the loadout, so in one of the last videos I asked you guys to leave a comment, and uh, it's very similar to what Level Cap does, but you guys really wanted to see it, so I decided to do it, and I've chosen to use Ryan Howell's loadout, the French Blue Devil loadout, primary using the Ribé Rolls, secondary the MLE, gadgets anti-tank and rocket gun, grenade, the normal frag, and the nail knife. Now, I don't have the nail knife, so I think I'm using the US trench knife because I'm trying to unlock the trench floor. And he says, make sure to adopt a very rush-heavy paced play style if using the loadout because the Blue Devils were the French equivalent of the German Empire's elite stormtroopers. Everything in this loadout is as accurate to the Blue Devils as possible and play different lines. Now, unfortunately, when we were playing this, we were playing with someone who doesn't have uh, premium and we didn't want to be dicks and uh, just... Uh, not play so we decided to play some operations we were the defending team but I played really rush heavy I was rushing them to where their spawn point was as you can see in this clip with the tank I'm just going to town on the tank um, so I feel like I played a very uh, rush heavy style and you guys will know if you've seen any of the videos I love the MLE as a secondary weapon so I was very happy that that was there but I also love the Ribé Rolls, and I haven't done a video on the Ribé Rolls, which is why I decided to choose this class up. There was a lot of good ones, and it was hard to choose, but I decided to use the Ribé Rolls because I really, really like using this gun. I feel it reminds me a lot of, um, like, the AK-74U. Um, really reminds me of, of that, and it, the long range is quite good if you control the recoil, and the, the bipod really helps out a lot. Uh, I really enjoy it, I really want a good skin for it, I've only got a, I think I've just got the normal, nothing there. So, yeah, I prefer using this to the Howl Eagle and the Automatico, and I'd say that I'd, I'd probably rather use this gun. The uh, anti-tank grenades, they're a must for this class, I'd say, if you're playing, a, I was playing so rush heavy with this thing, I was using grenades. Uh, the AT rocket gun constantly, like, you know, um, it was crazy the amount of sort of damage I'd say I was doing with this class. Really impressive against infantry, and even better when an armored vehicle would turn up. So, I definitely say it was a really good class. I'd say that um, everyone watching this video should really try this out. I think it's awesome. You should really have a go with this. If you don't have premium, um, unlucky, try and maybe, maybe save up for it, <laughs> but it was such a, I love this gun so much, like, um, it, I don't know what it is about it, I just really enjoy using it, but the frag grenade, you guys know, pretty much everyone likes the frag grenade, unless you're playing, um, rush or some sort of specific area game, then I always use the incendiary as, like, a tactical loadout, or smoke if I'm a medic and I'm playing on an operation game mode. Um, the melee, so I don't have the nail knife unfortunately, but I have uh, the sawtooth and trench, I'm working on the trench floor, I need like three more kills with it. Um, but we'll see, I really want to use that in the future at some point, it looks really nice as well. But back to the ribbon rolls and I would say that the only thing that lets this gun down is the ammo capacity. I feel like it's slightly low and that, that could put a lot of people off, but I really enjoy the gun and the fire rate is pretty good. Um, it's got a bayonet and like the Hell Regal, which I feel like the Hell Regal misses, but I have to say, uh, a lot of the clips in this, um, there aren't. I, I would use a bayonet, but the bayonet seems to just not work for me recently. I just can't get a kill with it. I don't know what's going on. But I just I love the way the gun the gun looks and the gun sounds and how how it uses and it's quite a fast reload so I really enjoy it and it was a very hard game to play the the enemy team was so good um, really really good team but I was playing so rush heavy as a defender I kind of enjoyed it actually normally I'm quite laid back defender but I would say. Thanks to Ryan for suggesting this uh, loadout. If you want to suggest one for the next episode, leave it down below. I'm going to be doing these every other week and the challenges as well. So the challenge video will be being recorded shortly. Uh, so this week it will be being uploaded. So look out for that and get ready to submit your other challenges. But I think I, I want to see 
for the next loadout, I would suggest you guys try and think of something that's maybe not used that much. Um, I saw some a few comments with the Hell Regal and the guns that I used a lot. I don't want to do that. Try and uh, pick something different. Um, something that no one really uses, maybe, uh, which could be a really cool idea. So, I think you guys could come up with you one. I'll pick my favourite as always. It depends what mood I'm in. I was just really in the mood to use some ribay rolls. It wasn't like anyone else's class was crap. It's just I really enjoy the ribay rolls and I haven't made a video on it yet. But guys, I hope you enjoy it, your weekend and uh, back to the normal week soon. But thanks for leaving a load out and leave a new one down below and I will catch you in the next video. Thank <laughs> you.